Well, no doubt after the holidays uh, now are behind us, uh, many view winter as well that uh, darkest and saddest season of them all. Well, this year, Yelp India is challenging you to change your outlook and embrace the cold with uh, one of the many Hoosier activities that you can find throughout the state. Yelp's uh, community director, Brittany Smith, returns now to help you get back on track with winter-inspired food and drinks and sports activities, That's right? That's right. You can be active outdoors in the winter. Absolutely. And what I love about this list, Brittany, it is a truly a, a statewide list. Every yes. corner of the state is uh, represented. So let's get right to it. Let's get okay. to the healthy stuff first. You know, we, <laughs> we're we, hanging we, on to those we, resolutions. We, exactly, <laughs> barely by fingernails. Yes. <laughs> but there are lots of places you can go to kind of get in that that health mode. Yes, to jumpstart it. Uh, mm -hmm. Natural Born Juicers is a great example of that. Their first location is right on Mass Ave. They started out of a food truck and have blossomed from there. Now they have a location in Noblesville at Broccoli Bills, and they offer juice cleanses. So if you're wanting to try something new three-day package you can make it tailored to you that's a really great example um, and going from there the garden table is another great one they have a juice flight which is really unique you you know you're used to wine flights and cheese flights you can sit down and try different juices local ingredients and they have a broad ripple location and just opened this past week on mass ave too yeah. and, and, and these are uh, truly entrepreneurs too, oh, business yes. owners who are are providing some really cool, unique things, but in the with a business model. Yeah, definitely, and I think it's showing that people are looking for healthy food options. That both of these businesses are expanding and opening new locations. Yep. All right. We uh, cold weather uh, can kind of get you down. You can always think about some drinks. <laughs> That's right. Uh, right. The right opposite now. of juice. We've got other kinds the of drinks, drinks. And, we've, and, and there are more and more distilleries yes. and breweries around the state. It's really fun. It's a good time of year to explore them. Right. Hotel Tango is a great mm -hmm. example in Fletcher Place, um, historic neighborhood. They have a great example that one of the top drinks that Yelpers are loving is their uh, Romeo rum in the winter, paired up with some apple cider. Uh, they got some orange and cloves, really good spices. And you can't beat their big stone fireplace in there. It's dog friendly. It's as cozy as it comes. And then on the flip side, you've got Upland Brewing in Bloomington. They're really spinning uh, the concept of a winter ale. People are usually doing a heavier brew. They are doing a, um, they're calling it the latitude adjustment adjustment, which means they're using coconut, they're using pineapple, really light ingredients. Yeah, Upland's doing some great things in, yes. in Bloomington. Uh, moving on, uh, coming out of the bicentennial, lots of Hoosiers are learning things mm -hmm. about the state, and you can do that in these winter months, too. Yeah, Levi Coffin House in Fountain City is a great example. So many people have probably been there uh, for a school field trip back mm -hmm. in the day. It's a great time to revisit. Um, last year, they added on 5,000 square feet of interpretive space um, right there, and, and the Smithsonian Magazine actually named it one of the top 12 museums in the world to check out in 2016. So I'm really encouraging people to go there. All right, and last but not least, embrace the outside. Embrace the cold, yes. right? Yes, that's right. Paoli Peaks is a great example that you can get out, you know, snow tubing, skiing, mm -hmm. you name it, you can check that out. And then you can go up north. You've got Indiana Dunes. The DR, DNR has so many great examples of trails throughout the state that you can visit. You can really be um, active and not let those cold temperatures hold you back. All right, great list as always from around the state. Uh, Brittany Smith, thanks for joining us. Thank we'll talk you. to you soon. Thank you, Gary. All right.